How hot are you from one to ten? It's fucking ten, baby. I'm a fucking ten. I'm eleven. You're looking at it right now. I, I, I am an eleven. I mean, like, tell me, put me up against anybody. I think it's mindset, baby. Mindset over anything. Yeah, he's an eleven. A hundred percent. Look at this shit. On a scale of one to ten, how attractive would you say you are? Oh. Uh. Ooh, I hate that question. I um. For, wow, that's a good question. When you say how hot am I from one to ten, what do you mean by that? Sexual market value. Oh, on a scale of one to ten. How attractive am I? In my perspective, right? How hot I am from one to ten, I would say... I would say I'm a strong... Three or four. Like, I'm, I'm like brim and average. I'm gonna get there one day, I'm a bloom. Like a, like a, like a three. I have really big boobs, so it kind of just works out. I'm a DC 7, a New York 5, and an LA 4. Well, if you ask myself, probably about a 4. Attractiveness, maybe four and a half. I've realized after becoming an actor that the picture I see in the mirror is not the picture that everybody else sees. Four and a half, maybe? I don't know. My boyfriend seems to like me, so I'd say that gives me at least a point or two. Four and a half. In LA, like a six out of ten. Like, in LA, girls have, like, big butts and... They're tiny and... I'll say six. I have the height to be hot, but I don't really have the body to say that I'm hot or face. I think I'm a solid six or seven. Right now, wearing a flesh-colored turtleneck, probably like a six. Well, I just moved from New York, so I'm pale as fuck. Physically, I'd say six and a half. Personality, I'm a 10. I'd say I'm like a like a six and a half, seven. Depends what mood I'm in, I can be real fun. Because like, you're more attractive if you're in a really good mood, you know? But usually I'm always in a good mood. So, I guess I'm a 10. I think in California, I'm like a six and a half. And in Nebraska, I'm like an eight. Everyone in LA is very, very attractive. If you're gonna be a 10 in LA, you, you're hot. How hot are you from one to 10? Six and a half. I'm just like a mediocre girl. I would personally say probably a seven, but I don't know because I feel like you guys are all judging me right now. <laughs> I would give myself a seven, you know, because I wish I was taller. I'd say at least a seven. I'd feel a little oily right now, so I think that might take it down a little bit. I don't know how it looks in the light. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it works. I don't know. What do you think? A uh, seven. Seven. Maybe a seven? Realistically, like a seven. Seven? What features make you a seven? My body. I think I have a nice body. Seven. Now, I do like to keep myself like at a retrospect with other human beings because people like Kendall Jenner do exist. If I'm being honest, I feel like my forehead is a little big. On average, I would say 7.2. I can be a 10. I can get to a 10. I would need a pair of heels. I would need lipstick. I think just those two things, honestly, and I could be a 10. I'm gonna say a seven and a half. Pretty cute face, decent build. I think my personality is pretty decent. Regular average, I would say maybe like an eight. I'm like a Midwest 10, but like an LA eight or seven. I mean, I don't think the scale goes high enough. I would say an eight. I'm not too sure. You guys can flame me in the comment section if you think I'm boosting myself up. Let's go with an eight today. Physically, I have some, you know what I mean? Like, I work out, you know, got, got a butt, that's great. And then also, like, personality, I think, really shines through as well. Eight. I'm pretty good looking. I'd be 10 if I was taller, a little bit buffer. Eight. I ain't no GQ, but I got one of the G's, you know what I mean? I, mean, I carries a little bit of that. If you're asking about attractive level or attractiveness, I'll give myself an eight. I'm not bad. I mean, look at me. My outfit's on point, my makeup's on point. I just feel really cute. Right now, solid eight. I think I'm an eight. <laughs> what if I said that and I was like, then I have a really big butt, which is true. Um, I wanna be confident and give myself an eight. You know, I think I need to get more in shape and feel more comfortable with my body, so that's something I've been working on. I used to be a dancer, I had a six pack, and 
There's no six back there. <laughs> Let's just say eight is the average. So I'm giving myself an eight. Eight. Without makeup, what are you? A three. Now that I have weave and I have contacts, my skin is clear, I would say a good eight, eight and a half. So my tall, kind of thick, you know, in the right places, I would say I'm a good eight and a half. Good eight and a half. Um, I think like my positivity makes me attractive and like people always compliment like my smile and how I'm super personable. Cause I feel like you can see a bad bitch, right? Like she could be fine, but then she could have a piss poor attitude and you're like, well damn bitch. And like, she's not cute anymore to you. I have big blue eyes with long eyelashes. I have a lot of hair, if you couldn't tell. I have a lot of hair. So I'd probably say an eight or a nine. I always think there's room to grow. I do think I'm pretty hot. I would say probably an eight and a half I would give myself. I think I'm a cool 8.5. 8.5. I think because I'm not buffy, I don't got no six pack, I'm kind of skinny still, so I think that it's holding me back just a little bit. Just a little bit. I would say like prime on a good day, like a solid eight or nine, like really feeling it. Oh, I'm about like a 9.5 for sure, if not a 10. At least I know I'm a 10 in like China. I'm like 20 feet taller than anybody. 10, can't you see that? At least my mom says that, so yeah. 10. I think everyone is a 10, but not everybody believes they're a 10. If you don't believe that you're a 10, then who's gonna believe that you're a 10? So I do believe I'm a 10, absolutely. Not only because I'm, you know, attractive, but because I just wanna have fun and I want everyone to have a good time. I'm not even gonna be humble about it, I'm gonna say 10. I'm a 100. <laughs> Always.